this video is sponsored by Crafton. Since the announcement of Inzoi around a week ago now, I've been receiving a lot of questions surrounding this game and I figured the best way for me to answer these questions is in a dedicated video. So today I'm going to be answering my most frequently asked questions. Now, one of the reasons that I'd like to create this video is that I, along with a few other creators, were actually contacted by Crafton who created this game and were asked to essentially play Inzoi in its current state and give feedback. So I do actually have a first-hand experience in playing Inzoi so I figure it's a really good opportunity for me to answer these questions for you. So let's get into it. Probably my most frequently asked question on the channel is when will Inzoi be released? Now the current feedback from the development team is that Inzoi is set to be released at the end of 2024. There's no specific date as of yet because the game is still quite early into development. The next question I get quite a lot is, will Inzoi be available on consoles, PlayStation and Xbox upon release? Now, while the development team are currently developing Inzoi to be released on PC, they have advised that this game will likely be available on consoles after the PC release. How long has Inzoi been in development? According to the development team, Inzoi has only been in development for one year. And I think considering it's only been a year, this game looks absolutely incredible. And I personally cannot wait to see what this game has to offer in another year's time. Another very valid question that I receive a lot is how much storage does Inzoi take up on your PC? At its current stage in development, and remember we are only a year into development, this is not the final product. I'll pop on screen for you now, but this game is currently taking up just over 30 gig on my hard drive. Is there a demo of Inzoi that you can play and how did I get to play Inzoi? Currently, there is no public demo available of Inzoi for anyone to play. This was a closed I wouldn't really call it a play test, although I suppose maybe it could be classed as one. Uh, but I don't know if that's subject to change. Maybe the development team will bring out some sort of demo at some point in the future, but that has not been confirmed. I got to play in Zoe because Crafton contacted me directly, along with a few other creators as well, because the team were really keen to hear our ideas and feedback, as well as the ideas and feedback of our communities. Another comment that I've been seeing a lot in my comment section, and again, it's very valid, is what specs were you running whilst playing in Zoe? I was actually playing in Zoe on two separate setups, one of which was my setup that I've had for a couple of years now. I'll pop the specs on screen for you now. And then Crafton also sent us a PC as well so that we could have the most optimized experience of playing in Zoe. And again, I'll pop those specifications on screen for you as well. If you'd like to pause the screen now to take a closer look, please feel free to do so. On both setups, I had absolutely no issues. And please note that on both setups, I was playing the game on medium settings as well. Can you build a house in Inzoi? You can build a house from scratch in Inzoi if you would like to and customize it in any way that you would like. If you're not too much of a builder as well, there are also options to build a pre-made house, which I think is a really handy feature, especially if you're not too confident with the building process. I've been getting this question quite frequently and that is, are there cutscenes in this game? Yes, there absolutely are cutscenes. For example, if your Zoys decide that they would like to have a baby, this is the cutscene that you are presented with. You can also have cutscenes for things like engagements and actually having the baby as well. Can you go to school with the child Zoys? So as you see here, the child Zoy currently has her backpack on and she is making her way to school. However, when you actually arrive at school, it, this building does act like a rabbit hole. So you're not actually able to attend school with the child. So you can't see them in lessons or anything like that. Can you go to work with your Zoi? Yes, you absolutely can attend work with your Zoi. And one of the really cool things about this is that you actually have a to-do list to work through as a player, which makes the experience a little bit more immersive. Are there height sliders? Currently, there are no height sliders in the character creation process, but as you can see here, we do have two different Zoys that are considerably different in height. So as you can see here, the Zoy on the left is considerably taller than the Zoy on the right, which indicates to me that this could be an option moving forward, but is not yet confirmed. Will there be expansion packs? According to the development team, this is not really something that they've taken into consideration as of yet because they're not really sure what the business model of this game actually looks like at this moment in time. But who knows, maybe we'll see expansion packs, maybe we won't. Will Inzoi be multiplayer? Again, not yet confirmed, but the development team have said that this is something that they have considered to be a feature of the game upon release. 
Well, that pretty much wraps up my most frequently asked questions on Enzoi, our brand new upcoming super realistic life simulation game set to release at some point in 2024. Please drop me any comments down below. I hope you found this video useful, but you all take care and I will see you next time I post a video. Bye.